Breast cancer is one of the most common cancers in the United States right now. Approximately one in eight women will be diagnosed with breast cancer at some point in their lifetime, and about five to 10% of those breast cancers will have a hereditary component or what we might even consider a hereditary cause to them. Now that we have both next generation sequencing, which allows for testing of multiple genes at a time, and also because we have learned more about some of the other genes that are out there, we are able to offer these larger panels that give patients even more information and better options for learning about their breast cancer risks. Breast Next is a panel that looks at 18 different genes that have been linked to hereditary susceptibility to breast cancer, including BRCA1 and BRCA2. Some of those genes are associated with known hereditary syndromes, and so if mutation is detected in one of them, there are definite guidelines and medical management recommendations to follow. They are clinically actionable, and we know a little bit about what those risks would entail. And for those that aren't part of a defined hereditary syndrome, we still know there is a significant increased risk of breast cancer, and that may lead to different recommendations that would have been made otherwise. With each of the 18 genes on the panel, in addition to the breast cancer risks, it is believed that there are other cancer risks associated as well. And so finding a mutation in one of the genes on the panel tells us not only about breast cancer risks, but possibly about other cancer risks as well, and that definitely impacts medical management.